Uh, I've, I've never programmed on a punch card before, so... Also, I lack any sort of machine that would be able to... ...to deal with a punch card, so... to use my money a little bit more wisely than dropping 20k on something that would let me run punch cards. If I was going to do anything, I would emulate that. I don't know this pattern. Yeah, Jeez Cookie, I have played TIS 100. It's really fun. I've also played MHRD, I think, um, which is the game where you're doing um, a hardware abstraction language, and that one's really, really fun. Um, for people who are interested in programming conceptually but have no idea where to start, I tend to recommend something like... Um, Usually, usually not TIS 100. Usually something more along the lines of, uh, like, Space Kim as a fantastic starting point. And then as people get more interested, things like Human Resource Machine is also really good. Really fond of the uh, the recent popularity of programming and programming adjacent uh, games. Shinzen IO. I've I've played a little bit of Shinzen IO. Um, I haven't played a lot of it. The whole... It, it... I don't know. Shinsen Ayo was... It, it ran really poorly on my machine through wine. Maybe that's been fixed by now. Oh, how about that RNG? But yeah, that on top of the, the weird... Like... I got to the point where it was like the... The owner of the company in the game was emailing you saying to play the game that his kid made. And it's like, well, this has gotten somewhere between hokey and disturbingly realistic. Yo, Abutu. Not having internet service, that's not good. That was entirely my fault. Like a heart, please. Drop a heart. Thank you. That's actually quite kind. That's fair.
worst at this video game. Oh well. Alright, just go. I have to not suck for the rest of the run and we might be able to world record. Three days, that's a... That's a long drive to reach your new place. I've done that one before. I've done the drive across the country to uh, to move thing. Depending on whether or not you like road trips, it can either be very, very fun or really miserable. you would be the one to drop something. Well, this room could have been better. Could have been a lot worse. Empty heart. This is what we're doing, huh? pace. Wasn't great. Wasn't terrible. Jumping off the side of the building. We're trying that this time. No, that's not faster. It was a cool idea. Definitely didn't work out that way, though. Yeah, I've, I've got Mario Kart Deluxe.
atmosphere. I mean, not actually. But... The game's not gonna let me argue against it, even if it's not fair. That was like... Next time I'm in Portland, I, uh, I'll have to let you know, Cheese Cookie. I didn't know that that's a easy spot for you to make it out to. Clean room. <laughs> Terrible drops. Not even close to what I was hoping for. Yeah, that's actually substantially easier if you use fire there. Probably losing some time here. Yeah, Seattle is so fun. It's a lovely city to hang out in. Been there a few times for conferences now, and I always love it. That's, that's not the same thing as, as losing time. Well, that could have been better. That also could have been better.
No, I wanted to pick that up. Yo. Worth the gamble. It's fine. Okay, now we have some substantially less uh, farming that we have to do. So this is going to be a pretty okay time. I'm a little bit concerned about my lack of potions. So dropping a potion would be... Oh, good thing I did switch to that one. Would have taken a hit otherwise. about the d-pad. So we just have to not beef it due to potions. I'm gonna do my best not to beef it. I said I didn't want to beef it. Yeah, money-wise, we're doing pretty okay. Potion-wise, I'm still scared.
Okay, potion-wise, I'm actually really scared. Anybody could drop hearts or potions, and I'd be pretty okay with it. Thank you. Okay, now potions. While we're being team players, just, like, drop three potions. I won't tell anyone. Just be between you, me, and the world record VOD. Promise. Okay, one equipment drop was was enough. I guess going for two was great. Come on. I'm already pretty much kissing this run goodbye, if I'm being honest. No, why did I do that? It's fine. Almost beat her. Gosh, this is It's not over yet. There's there's a lot that can still go wrong with this run. So let's not let's not count our chickens before they hatch. That said, we're in okay shape. I've already got enough for the task sword, so I don't really have to farm at all. sitting pretty pretty good with uh, fire magic as well yeah, I'll take that. let's not blow a world record to stupidity needed to have happen. <laughs> it's 
it's okay. So real talk, if I had landed on that fireball, it would have been run over. I, I want this potion. We could get some potion drops. I would not complain for potion drops. I mean, yes, so I'm 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 presently in the green. I need that. I'm in the green, and that's good, but I didn't need that. But it's important to remember that while I am in the green, those sunflowers were one hit kills. So until basically until we're through Daimyo. I'm really scared of this run. Go in the... Thank you. This is the one that can drop it. No such luck. Don't care. Just go. I actually care quite a bit looking at my health. Heart drops would be really cool. shield. Cool. I didn't know that that shield could drop here. I really want a heart, though. Thank you. Better believe I'm gonna buy one more potion. This is, this is absolutely gonna turn into a world record. Strong bird, bird fly in armor. So it's a, like, micro-optimization, but starting flying immediately out of that door is very, very slightly faster because you get more horizontal momentum.
so I guess we get this way. Still fine. Let's go this way. Oh, that was fast. That was super fast. controller please there we go all right we're back on track this way Not what I meant to do there. Right, let's play it just a little bit safe. That was a good fight. Yo, sub-35! Okay. I'm pretty happy about that. Okay, so I felt really, really good about the sub-35 easy. Um, I did not anticipate getting a sub-35 normal today. Holy cow. Yo, Mungo dude, how's it going? We've got some new world records, dude. Um I forget what my what my times are in uh in any percent, but no major glitches might be faster than any percent right now. I'm feeling pretty good about this run for uh, speedrun to change the world. I'm feeling really, really good about this run for speedrun to change the world. Thanks for the GG. Gosh, this was a this was a heck of a run. I know my 35 minute run was a trash run now. I thought that I was pretty happy with it, but that was silly. I was not happy with it at all.
Uh, smurfed in so far, uh, two, two world records today. We just got sub-35 on, uh, on easy and then sub-35 on normal on the run back, so... It's, it's pretty okay. Feeling, feeling like runs have been, been alright today. Uh, G's Cookie. So, uh, when I was doing the ROP, um, I basically ignored the source code. Like, yeah, they gave us the source code, but 100% of the work that I did was inside GDB. Like, we identified that we could sig fault a binary. Um, we opened it up in GDB, we caused a sig fault, we looked at the way that the stack was laid out, what was happening. We verified that we were getting control over the instruction pointer and, and we crafted our exploit from there. Um, having access to the source code is a pretty good way to find out where a vulnerability probably lives. Yeah, we just, I, I mean, in fairness, the first thing that we did was we just ran it with a bunch of A's. <laughs> like we just, we, we overflowed a buffer, um, which is not uncommon. But yeah, if you do a uh, if you do a read elf to get symbols, and you search for uh, for unsafe string operations, that's usually a good place to start if you're looking for binaries to exploit. Like it's it's by no means the only way, but if you find unsafe string operations, you've usually got a pretty good bet. That, that something bad is going on. Yeah, Mungo dude, my uh I mean, I'm I'm 20 seconds off of some of best now for this for this category. So that's not that's not too bad. I'm we're gonna have to start getting creative with routing to figure out new time saves. So yeah, it's by no means optimal. Like, I'm still getting one heart. We could skip fish heart. But fish heart is such a... It's like... What? Five seconds for that animation? It'll be a bigger time save in... Uh, in any percent. Compared to no major glitches. But still. Fish heart feels like... Like the one heart that we can't skip. And once we get to the point where we're skipping fish heart because it, it saves too much time for us to lose the world record, that's how we'll know that we've got a we've got a real speed game TM trademark on our hands. Yo, glitch garden. Yeah, I kind of world recorded it a little bit. It happened. Don't worry though. You're back just in time to watch me be bad at video games. And I know that that's what everybody shows up for anyway. Because we're before I say that I should check the time. Yeah, we're not done tonight. 